Hey, what's going on everyone? I wanted to kind of do a little bit of a contest update and uh, just tell you what was going on. We're still giving away the CRKT shenanigan, so don't worry about that. But uh, I had told you that I was going to do another contest for a Spyderco knife later in the month. And actually what my plan was to um, give away this, the Spyderco, um, I just had a brain fart, the Manix 2 Translucent Blue. But since I was having some issues with just the deployment and how um, how much tension and pressure there is on it, I've decided to go ahead and hold off on that because I'm actually going to send this knife back to Spyderco and um, give them a chance to fix it. And um, then I'll, I'll do an update video when I get it back, let everyone know what happened with that, and then decide what I want to do with the knife after that. But anyways... Um, also, I just wanted to say I'm I was gonna do a review on the shenanigan, but I'm actually not going to I want to give whoever wins this the opportunity or the chance to um, Review it themselves if they win and they have a YouTube channel just so um, you know our reviews aren't kind of competing with each other or or anything similar, but I did want to kind of just give you guys a closer look of, of the knife and um, Just kind of point a couple things out on this particular one, the one you would win, there is a couple imperfections on the pocket clip. There's like a little kind of a wear mark right there, and then another one up here. It's kind of hard to focus on that, but hopefully you can see it. Um, it is a brand new knife. The edge has never been cut with. Deployment is really smooth, but uh, I just wanted to point that out, that there are a couple little slight imperfections, and I don't want you to expect to get like... A perfect knife you know it is in great shape it's brand new but you know there are a couple of uh, I guess you'd say imperfections from the factory um, just from what I can tell just those two little dots on the side of the pocket clip there um, the blade centering is a little bit off but not much um, it does not touch the the handles at all either side of the blade so even though the centering is off still deploys smoothly and when it close closes the blade does not rub on the handles on either side so um, overall the quality is really good the deployment just super super smooth if I was to um, disengage the liner lock the blade pretty much swings freely I mean it's kind of hard to get that in this angle right here but it's just it's silky smooth compared to what this uh, this Manix 2 is especially so Anyways, I just wanted to kind of give a little update of that and give you guys a little bit of a closer look of this uh, CRKT shenanigan. Great little knife. I really like mine. Um, I think you guys are going to be happy, whoever wins it. So uh, that's about it. Just wanted to give a little update. And um, like I said, this contest for this knife is still going on. So go ahead and uh, get your entry in if you haven't. Tell your friends if you want to. And... Um, Possibly a future contest for this knife, although I'm unsure about that. I'm going to send it into Spyderco to get it looked at and see if maybe they can fix the deployment issue I'm having with it. But um, otherwise, you know, I'm really kind of falling in love with this knife. I really love the grip of it and um, the blade shape, the steel I'm actually liking. Um, it's just really the deployment. It's just really, really stiff. So I want to see if Spyderco can maybe fix that. I want to give them a chance to do that, but... Man, the lockup on this knife is super solid. No blade play either, front to back, side to side, nothing. Um, and also on the shenanigan, same thing. No blade play, side to side, or front to back. There's nothing. It's just a real solid lockup. Also wanted to show you the lockup if I can. Um, the lockup on the shenanigan is pretty early. But uh, if I had to estimate, I'd say it's about... I don't know, like 30% or something like that. But you can kind of see that in the camera. So anyways, I'm on my lunch break. Just going to get back to work. So I uh, just want to do a little update. Hope you guys are enjoying your day, and I'll talk to you later. Peace.